Gather round, everyone, for I have a story to tell. In a kingdom filled with magic, there once lived a fairy princess. As a daughter of royalty, she was kept under lock and key, hidden from the world and sheltered from the experiences that make life worth living. In an act of rebellious desperation, she fled the kingdom, hoping to finally begin living life free from the oppressive nature of the royal family. Despite her greatest efforts, the fairy princess was captured and sent to an asylum for the magically insane. The fairy was distraught, feeling as though she were doomed to a life of solitude. Until she met someone. A member of the High Wizard Council, known simply as the Dreamer, who was assigned to diagnose and treat the fairy. After many meetings, the two fell in love with one another. Eventually, a plan to elope was set in motion. The Dreamer and the Fairy Princess escaped the confines of that asylum and fled to the countryside. However, the High Wizard Council was incredibly displeased by the Dreamer's actions. The Council began their search for the runaway lovers. A year later, the couple had a baby boy. Half fairy, half human. A quiet countryside life was a comfortable existence that helped keep them hidden from the High Council. But not forever. At the tender age of two years old, a young boy was playing outside when he spotted a strange tree. From that tree sprouted a glistening golden banana. The child, being curious, picked the fruit, peeled it, and ate it happily. In a matter of moments, the child fell to the floor, unconscious. When he awoke, he was met by the worried eyes of his mother and father, the only evidence of what had occurred being the golden peel that remained. The High Council had finally found them. While the dreamer's magic was powerful enough to keep the Council from encroaching on his family, they had found a single weakness. Beneath the soil in the earth, they were able to create a cursed tree that bore the fruit of their vengeance that would afflict the child. A devilish punishment for the escaped lovers. Now having a forbidden curse upon him, the child underwent a horrific transformation under the light of the full moon. And thus, a were-banana was born. After years of being afflicted with this curse, the young man now travels the world, keeping his secrets close to his heart, and becoming an entertainer. He discovered that his curse had a certain appeal. In spite of the hand life had dealt him, he worked hard and eventually became the premium entertainer in the kingdom. What new adventures await for this banana lad? Ha ha ha.